What do you call a factory that makes okay products? Satisfactory. Just like this room, this room is by far beyond satisfactory. I am very pleased with it. This room took a lot longer than I originally thought. I started this about two months ago and I thought I was gonna finish it in a week. Very, very ambitious of me. I'm just really excited to finally have a filming corner. Basically, it just adds on a touch to my videos. I feel like it looks so much more professional. And when I mean this is a transformation, I mean it is an HGTV transformation. This is transformation room on a budget. I think it was around less or a little over than $600. I will put links for the products that I used in the description box. If you find something that you like, I will link it for you because we're trying to have bougie bedrooms. I'm trying to adult here. I feel like I'm officially an adult. Once you add bookshelves, you're an adult. <laughs> I'm reaching an age of being wiser, more mature, and just overall just having my shit together. Granted, I did buy fake plants, but it looks good. I mean, we'll save that for the reveal, but you'll see me go through multiple different places. I went to a thrift store. I went to TJ Maxx. I went to Michael's. I went to an art store. I went to Target. I think this took a lot longer in time just because I didn't have all the money I wanted to spend on it right away. I had to like space it out between paydays like a normal person. Another reason why it was taking so much time is because the paintings that I decided to do were a lot more complex than I thought it was gonna be. You'll figure that out too. I'll throw some projects in there. We're gonna have a good time together. It's gonna be amazing, I hope. I think that's it. Before we go into all the footage and we do some fortsy fortsy magic. My name is Kat Kinway and this is my channel. My art channel, my home decor channel. It's me, it's me and mostly doing art, but also doing stuff like this. You ma'am, you guilty. My laundry, my husband's trash, my husband's other trash, and there's my trash. I'm a hypocrite. Yeah. I love these paintings. My plan is I'm going to move my vanity to the side. We're going to move the bed over. I'm keeping my bed because it's decent. I'm keeping this thing over there. I was going to buy a plant, but literally every plant that I buy, it dies. It dies with my dreams. And I'm also going to probably paint a nightstand. Decided. Before I do all of this fun decorating and moving furniture around and finding stuff, we have to clean. I also have this is jar that I think I could use. I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah. Can you tell me why? Can you tell me why? I'm down. That's yeah. just gross. No friends of mine, no friends of mine around, yeah. Now I'm thinking now, now I'm thinking now. By the cottage room blows, yeah. I wanna try myself inside the juice, yeah. We don't need to worry about that. Laundry! Such a sweet girl. Mm -hmm. So I'm going to paint this black. We're gonna take both of them and put them in the bedroom instead. I just don't like this nightstand. I, I've never liked it. And we're gonna move the vanity over there and laundry. <laughs> You ain't peak, never speaking, not it speaking about you, leave it alone. Hope you're grinning while you watch your bros. On some sofa, sunny shit to brighten up a wounded soul. Honest, you the penny, uh, pick a dull like Chevy, uh, new age Machiavelli, uh, disagree, don't tell me, uh, now you in infinity, we 98, trust that he be good. On the ball like BB, don't make no mistakes, got the faith. The 18 just not gonna be the same. Finna be down generations, not gonna be in vain. Too young, why you gotta go, why you gotta go? I just wanna know, I just wanna know, nah, nah, nah. Try and get no, try and get no. 
unknown Hope you free your soul, hope you free your soul I might have caught the June flu Yeah, I wanna Drown myself inside the juice Yeah, you know I Keep on running from the truth Was that not? I'm just a lonely fucking you Now when I Be moving things, huh? Yeah bought these frames right here I really really liked the color on them so I'm gonna use the frames not the art sorry not my style but we are going to paint our own art for it using Posca markers so I thought these were art and then I opened it up it's a homemade card to somebody who I assume is dead because it was at a thrift store this one's also a card from someone's daughter. Mom really liked these cards, so I feel kind of bad for throwing it away, but I don't want no bad juju in here, you know? Also bought these baskets for $4 each. I'm not really quite sure if I'm going to use them or not, but if I don't use them in here, I definitely will use them in my art studio. I got two different sizes of canvas board. I'm going to use these to do one big painting above the bed. I got two different sizes because I'm not sure if I'm going to mix and match them or if I'm just going to use one size. I'm going to keep this art right here. However, I am going to add more to it with light pink and blue along with different shades of green. And we are going to use some Posca markers for this. Gold and light blue are going to be the accent colors. I got this pillow at the thrift store for about $3. I got this scratch off map in black and gold. I found this at the thrift store as well. I'm pretty sure I got it for about $5. I'm going to hang it on my filming wall and I will show you where that's going to go. So here's the window. This is going to go right there. There's going to be some white shelves that I'm ordering off of Amazon that are gonna go right here. And I also ordered a chair, a decorative chair that'll go right here. They're about $50 all together for the light green and pink pillows from TJ Maxx. It's really velvety looking. some shelves because Amazon did not want to deliver it. I ordered these shelves off of Amazon twice and they kept saying delivered but they never showed up and I didn't feel like fighting with the post office about it because it was only $25. Gorgeous. Another throw blanket because why not? I need a place for more 
jackets to be hung. And that needs to be decluttered. Got this box of fake flowers. Got these candles to put in my candle holders, which I need to clean out because there's a lot of wax in them. Got another fake plant. Yay! I've managed to keep this one alive, but I only have to water this one every three months, so it's not too hard to keep that one alive. I got this frame for the map. I'm excited to finish it this weekend. Gotta finish some projects first. Look at those veins. Look at them poppers. You have a little alfalfa going on. I'll put the helmet back on. Welcome to my fabulous corner called Fabulous Corner. <laughs> Ooh la la. Ooh, I love the guy. It's the aesthetic. Mr. Man with his man tools. Mm -hmm. Level, I think. We're gonna find out real quick. <laughs> okay. Okay. And actually level. Yes! Do you like that up on there like that? Yeah, I okay. like it. More leveling, yeah. More screwing. I don't know what I'm doing. Yeah. I can't do this with one hand, so bye! Flower arranged. I arranged the flowers. Oh, he's too big. I'm here for the cracks in the painting. So I have a lot to do. Basically have to finish all of these paintings by tomorrow. It's 6 30 at night, so I'm gonna try to speed through this, I guess. I also wanna try and do two of these for the shelves. I'm gonna make these like simple color blocky kind of and these are gonna be more detailed so I'm hoping I can get it all done tonight. Things kind of look really messy right now but I think it's coming together. Yeah, put down your defense, yeah. I know myself and I get worse around the evening, yeah. And I know that it gets harder when I don't sleep or drink water. She the only peace of mind I want to part of. I'm here for the cracks in the painting, all day raining. The problems that I never want to solve. I'm here for the bad that you came with. I never want to change it. We got our minds and that's why we involved. That's what, that's what, that's what makes you good. That's what, that's what makes you good. Hello and welcome to the voiceover. I figured I would take this time to mention that I did not get any curtains for my window because my window is really big. The ceilings in my apartment are actually really high and I can't find an appropriate length of curtain that fits the window. So I decided not to get any, plus the window itself is already beautiful, so it'll be all right. I also wanted to mention that I did not show my comforter that I bought. I bought that off of Amazon. It was $40. It was the cheapest one I could find, and I couldn't really find any good options for a green comforter. I didn't want to do light colors because I have dogs, so I wanted a darker, fun color. Anyways, enough of this chit chat. Let's go back into the speed painting. I'm here for the cracks in the painting, all day raining, the problems that I never want to solve. I'm here for the bag that you came with, I never want to change it. We got our minds and that's why we involved. That's what, that's what, that's what makes you good. That's what, that's what makes you good. That's what, that's what makes you good. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. There must be something that feeds her. You'll find the beauty goes much deeper once you get to meet her. 
Ha ha, you thought I wasn't gonna do a voiceover. So yeah, gotcha there. Anyways, I just wanted to say these two pieces that I'm doing right now are pretty color blocky. They're very simple, very abstract. If you would like to follow along with me, you definitely can. It's super, super easy, super, super simple. This can be done on a larger scale than the small frames that I did. I personally just liked how small they were and how they looked in the frame, so I kept it how it was. But I feel like anyone can do this. You just do all the fun squiggle lines, pick your color palette out, pick about three around the same colors and one shiny one, like a gold or a silver, and it will literally make your place look so expensive. This is a very simple, bougie art trick. And everybody knows that as artists, we pour our soul into art, so we want it to look beautiful. And I think it does. I think it looks fabulous on my wall, and you should do that for you too. Because art makes you happy. Tell me that you don't put a painting on a wall and you don't instantly feel better. You don't instantly feel more at home once you hang a painting on the wall. If I'm just making stuff up here, let me know, but I feel more homey whenever I put paintings on my walls. They get my cash back. You be looking fine, so no wonder they can match that. Louis V scar for I'm chilling with a dad. Whoa. Slow it down like that. Just hold me down like that. Up room. A few questions for you. What did you think about it? The room transformation, I mean. Did you like it? Did you think it could need something different? Or were you just like totally blown away? After watching this video, you know that I like to draw space themed art. I think it's just fun. My question to you is if you're an artist, what do you like to draw? What's your medium that you use? If you're not an artist and you're just watching this because you love room transformations, let me know your favorite color palette for your room. Thank you so much for your time. Thank you so much for your energy and to having your mind watch this long enough and be engaged with it enough to where you love me. If you don't, that's fine. It's fine. But if you do decide to love me, can you hit a like and subscribe? Let's be besties. Who doesn't want an artist bestie? I mean, don't really know anyone that doesn't want an artist bestie, so. Peace, love, and magic. I love you like la 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 la.